Hey guys, I really hope you enjoyed our last episode when I got to show you the basics of sous vide cooking and the equipment involved. You know what? I want to put that method to the test today by cooking the perfect mid-rare strip steak. No cryovac machines are necessary because we're using the water displacement method using nothing above and beyond a Ziploc bag. So fire up your precision cookers and let me show you how it's done. Let's get started. I have my marinated strip steak, which I just simply put nothing above and beyond garlic and rosemary and a touch of olive oil. And I'm just gonna put it in the Ziploc bag all the way to the bottom. So this is the water displacement method. This bag has a lot of air in it. Try and squeeze out as much as you can. Place the steak right in the water. And as it sinks, it's gonna push the air to the top. Now it may not sink all the way, so it needs some help with a pair of tongs or a spoon. Slowly push it down and you see the air is being forced out and it's creating a seal. So keep that going all the way down to the bottom with the tongs. And when you get to the bottom, simply seal it. I'm just gonna pull this out and show you guys. As you can see through that water displacement method, we've pretty much removed most of the air from that. It's not perfectly airtight, but it has created like a nice seal as you can see. So we're just gonna put this right back in the water and we're gonna clip it and set the timer. Our timer has gone off after one hour. It's reached a perfect temperature of 129 degrees. Let's move it over. I'm gonna grab some tongs because this is really hot and I'm just gonna place it right on the plate. I wanna pat any additional liquid off because it's gonna help us with the browning process. And I'm just gonna season it lightly with some salt and some pepper. I have a cast iron skillet ready to go and we're gonna give it a quick sear. With a little olive oil, it's smoking really, really hot. 30 seconds on each side. All right, let's flip it over and do the other side for another 30 seconds. Nice, beautiful brown color. All right, let's slice it open, guys. Absolutely beautiful. Cooked perfectly from edge the edge with a little bit of a sear. Couldn't be more perfect. And it's gonna be so tender, wow. Look at that color, absolutely perfect. So guys, as you saw, cooking the steak sous vide style produce a perfect mid-rare from edge to edge, which is exactly what we were looking for. It was Fork tender, delicious, juicy, and it melted in my mouth. I'm so stoked. And please look forward to more innovative sous vide recipes here from Danny Max Kitchen. I can't wait to show you. I have so many cool things that I want to uh, present to you guys. And I'm just ecstatic about this cooking method and I hope you are too. Till next time, I will see you soon.